Hi. We're going to talk about the use of cannabis for low appetite, which is medically known as anorexia. But you can use cannabis for a whole range of low appetite conditions, just ranging from someone who has a high metabolism and doesn't really eat enough to keep their weight up, all the way through people with cancer who lose their appetite due to chemotherapy, possibly for HIV patients on um, suppressant drugs that ruin their appetite, and even into a full-blown case of anorexia, such as anorexia nervosa, which is actually uh, a panic, obsessive, compulsive disorder syndrome. So that's going to require a different kind of cannabis. For general appetite stimulation, you're going to have to stick with THC. That's the component in cannabis that stimulates appetite. CBD is absolutely not useful here. It's not an appetite stimulant, and it won't help. But if you're worried about psychoactivity, you can use a mix of THC and CBD. Try to stick more with at least a 50-50 blend so you get enough THC in your system to actually do some good. If you're trying to stimulate your appetite three or four times a day, obviously edibles might not be the best way to go because they last eight to 10 hours. So a typical routine for appetite stimulation is to have a couple of puffs of vaporized THC or even smoked THC before each meal. That'll come on in about 10 to 15 minutes and your appetite should go up. So that would be one or two puffs three times a day. Or if you're trying to treat anorexia nervosa, which is actually an anxiety disorder condition, that's where some CBD might really be helpful. Because as the patient calms down and is less worried, then some of their natural appetite might have a chance to surface. So you definitely want to use at least your one-to-one -one mixes of THC and CBD in that case. And in this case, it's good to control the anxiety all day long. So I would go with maybe a sublingual tincture and do a dose three times a day, keep the patient calmer, and get your THC in there to uh, stimulate your appetite.